feel when there's so much we have to offer the world, the Western world, to the American world, we can give them peace, we can give them natural healing, yeah. we can give them joy, we can give yeah. them happiness with with flower power uh -huh. and herb power, natural power. <laughs> right, right. Why why don't we? Why can't we? Why are not, are we not? Meet Shanaz Hussein. I traveled to New Delhi to meet Ms. Hussein, the woman behind one of the best-known beauty brands in India. Which one? Small motives, purposeless. Uh, yeah. It should be your what? It should be your picture. Mm -hmm. Ms. Hussein says she has tried using packaging without her photo on it, but it never sells as well. I spent four days with her and her enormous entourage. All of this video footage is from her staff cameramen who chronicle her days in order to give fresh footage to the local media and so she can remember her adventures. Ms. Hussein says she is a princess, descended from a royal mogul family. She keeps a household staff of about 60 employees, including live-in cooks, drivers, housekeepers, tailors, makeup artists, and even a florist. Learning about Ms. Hussein's lavish lifestyle meant I got to try parts of her extensive beauty regimen, including her nightly foot massages. Ms. Hussein started her business almost 40 years ago. She began by creating simple beauty treatments in her home based on India's ancient science of Ayurveda. Now she runs a business that includes about 300 salons, 53 beauty schools, 3,000 employees, and nearly two dozen product lines sold throughout India, Asia, and Europe. Shanaz Hussein is famous in India. During late night visits to her favorite coffee shop, which we went to every day, fans always recognized her. She said she designs her own clothes. This outfit had trim and giant pockets made from Louis Vuitton handbags. In the sitting room she calls the White House, Ms. Hussein told me she wants to make a bigger push into the U.S. soon. Western world, you must write that, Western world is color and cover. Yeah. Cover it in color. Yeah. India's care and cure. Yeah. Okay. For the Wall Street Journal, this is Ellen Byron.